What's good you guys, this is your boy back with another video and today this is my 100th video. So I've posted 99 videos already, this is going to be the 100th one. And you know, to celebrate that, I got a little story time for you guys. This story time is about me stealing. So you guys might be asking, damn, what, what did you steal? And you, you know, it was, it was a Beyblade. So you, you know this happened a little while ago. Uh, let's, let's get right into the story. Anyways, this story happens, I was in sixth grade, I'm, I'm pretty sure, and for some reason, like, around my school, Beyblades was just getting, like, very popular for some reason, like, I don't know why, everybody had one, and so the way I got mine was my friend, he had, like, a, like a, like a really shitty one, right, like, like, everything was, like, very shit, and he just gave it to me for free, and what people were doing was, like, trading parts for the shit, and so I didn't really know what I was doing. So I just traded the first person who offered me a trade. And you know what I'm saying? It turns out, you know, I, I traded with him. And then I I went back to the kid who gave me the Beyblade. And I was like, is this a better piece? And he was like, nah, your piece was way better you had before. And I was like, damn, bro, I just got scammed. Because I asked the dude, I was like, hey, is this one better? I don't know why the hell he would say yes. I was like, you know what I'm saying? Pretty bad on my part. Uh. So I went to the kid, this the kid who, who scammed me. He was white, by the way, just in case you were wondering. He, um, I asked for it back. I was like, yo, can I get my shit back? And he says, oh, I already, I already traded it with somebody else. And I was like, what? And I was like, no fucking way. This all happened in the same day. I got this shit. Wait, did I get it the day before? I don't know. I got it, traded it, I traded a piece and got scammed. And I was like, damn, I have to get my get back. You know what I'm saying? I've never been pussy, so. So what ended up happening is, I don't have any classes with this kid except for seventh, is it seventh? Yeah, seventh period. It was eighth, eight periods in my in my school, right? Seventh, eighth, and then I'm going home. So what ends up happening is, um, I'm like, he sits on the whole other side of the classroom. So my mind is like, yo, I gotta get this shit back. His stuff is laying on his desk right there. Was it? No, no, it wasn't laying on the desk. So, what I did, I was like, I was talking to my friend. He was like, yo, can I get, he wanted something from the Beyblade, like a, a piece. And I was like, yo, you're gonna, you're gonna distract him. I'm gonna take it. And then, if he sees me, you're gonna hold him and I'm gonna run away with it. And then I'm gonna give you the piece afterwards. So, you know, we was about to do that shit. And I was like, yeah, all right, I'm ready. So I'm talking about the Beyblades, da, 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 da. I grabbed it, and then I was about to run, and then I realized I'm in the middle of class. Like, I can't just run out of the classroom. So I just felt like a dumbass right there. So I was like, damn, fuck. So I, I just gave it back to him, like, like you know, yeah, that's it, you know what I'm saying? So I was just, after that shit happened, that dumbass shit I did, I sit back in my chair, and I'm just like thinking, I'm like, damn, I fucked it all up, bro. And then at the last second, I was like, I told the kid who I was with, he was Mexican, by the way, and he was fat, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if it has correlation, but you know what I'm saying? The, the word. Anyways, I told him, I'm like, yo, uh, the bells, when the bell rings, uh, you gonna, I'm going to grab it, you going to hold him back, and I'm just going to run. So that's that's what that can happen. I was like, I hear the bell ring. I was like, hey, you know, you know, I was just playing, right? Boom, grab your shit. I'm running. Boom. But you know, this, this, you know, he held it off for like two seconds, and then when I got outside, so imagine, I ran out of the classroom, right? I went this way, but that doesn't go nowhere. So, but I, so I had to go this way. So I went this way for a second. I was like, oh shit, I gotta go this way. That gave enough time for the white kid um to to block the whole the hallway way right so i'm like uh what do i do so i just fucking juked him pushed him out of the way and started running down the hallway running down the hallway meanwhile all my classes are in this hallway so i can't like just run to my class he's gonna see me so i go downstairs and i go out of the whole building and then i go to the seventh grade building right i go to the seventh grade a building where there is a whole bunch of shit and I'm going up the stairs which is the eighth grade building where I was gonna go so I go I'm going up the stairs 
there's a whole bunch of people on the stairs and why i have to wait for the people because you know i can't run over them and while this is happening somebody grabbed me by my back like just imagine you know you're running from them and they just grab you like this accidentally stopped recording my bad guys anyways bro somebody grabbed me i'm like no way like you don't know how like scared i was i was getting ready to fight back i turned around and this is is it was uh it was my uh my friend who, who was in eighth grade so bro i was the shit scared out of me like my i was like i was like damn they got me bro and i was like you know what i'm saying i thought i was done and i, I saw him and i was like oh shit no, no, no I'm, I'm stealing from somebody right now man chill out you know what I'm saying? He was understanding, surprisingly, you know, I, you know, because of the circumstances. Anyways, from there, he, oh, wait, no, from there, I went upstairs to the eighth grade hallway, right? And, but in the eighth grade hallway and the sixth grade hallway, they're like, they're connected by this little like overpass, like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. So I went back there. I was in my class and I was just there hiding, bro, because I was scared. And mind you, this, this, this is the day before uh, a break like you know like a long break i don't know which break it was but it was you know what i'm saying i was like damn i'm not if i get away with this i'm not gonna see him for a long time boom i'm in my class and uh i got the beyblade i'm showing my friend who you know i'm telling you he was the one who gave it to me he was like oh shit this one is better than mine all this stuff so boom i hook up my little blade blade my beyblade have everything you know fucking max and um i go home and during the break, I fucking lost the Beyblade, and I just never played with it again. So I just ruined this kid's, you know, you know, I just ruined his shit by stealing from him, and I, I didn't even get to use it. So, you know, the the story would end there, but uh, I actually got caught by my by my mom, when, you know, being a dumbass, because I, I text my friend, because I, I, I never stole from nobody before. So I text my friend, I was like, yo, I stole from this kid, da, da, da. I'm texting him about it. Then my mom had my phone, like, later that day. I don't know. And then she looks at my messages, and it was like, did you steal the Beyblade you have? And I was like, yeah. I got in trouble, so don't steal, kids. Anyway, anyway guys, if you liked the video, hit the like button. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.